What's going on, everyone? Juice Bags here, and welcome to the most scuffed Ruthless Hardcore The Summit run you will ever see. But I'm going to try to get this win here. This one has been a little bit of a challenge for me. Um, it's a little bit harder than the rest of the maps. And one thing that I have uh, come to the conclusion of quite quickly is that my DPS heroes... Um, although they get the job done throughout so much of the game, they just suck. <laughs> I need to get these guys dialed in just a little bit more, that is for certain. Uh, so we're going to start off here with uh, a couple of Aura stacks, the usual suspects, uh, for me anyway. Um, I know a lot of people don't use the uh, electric Rs anymore, but I am still a bit of a fan. Let's see, so we're going uh, Ensnare, Electric, and a Strength Drain. And then what? We've got uh, a little bit more juice laying around. We're going to go one big old buff beam down. And then um, try to get in some Hermit Defenses as well. Uh, before it is all said and done. But we're going to have to see how the, clock, how the clock ticks away here as far as that goes. 30 seconds left. Let's at least get our buff beam down. We are uh, definitely pushing it a little for time on the rest. So we're going to get a big old fatty in there. And then do we have time for the hermit? Let's get something down anyway. Let's go with... Um, let's see, let's get a nature pylon and then a mushroom and then try to swap back. Didn't even drop the mana. Let's go on our Jester here for the first wave. Just trying to get, um, hopefully get a few upgrades in. Now, I am uh, terribly, terribly out of practice with uh, Jester play. So the wheeling, um, you know, obviously could get a lot of uh, benefit out of slapping the wheels down. But mainly I'm using them so I can get upgrades in. And then when it comes to situations like this, I can swap over to my staff and get some uh, semi-respectable DPS down as well. Just try to get as many upgrades in as we can here. I think I'm going to bring some boosters in too on this one. Uh, maybe even two. My thought here on this one, since um, I'm just not able to just smack the map like I would like to think I could uh, with my DPS heroes. So I think the plan here is I'm going to try to kill um, the boss with towers. And I'm not sure how well that's going to work out. Uh, in fact, I should have threw down a healing R2. We're actually at the end, so let me... Let me not throw any more upgrades here yet. So let's get that healing R down first, and then we'll throw down um, a golem. And then I think we're just going to spam the living poo out of DSTs. Let's see, let's get a uh, healing R down. We'll just slap it right there. Uh, let's get our golem down. We're going to slap him like right there. Now, I want to make sure I have enough DU left over for buff beams as well. well. Let's see what we could do. Like, if I go two every direction, I think I would feel pretty good about that. So if we get two that way, kind of two, two that way, go a couple this way. Just get them spread down. I think I'm going to have to uh, gather mana and play on my... What is that? That's 144. All right, so I didn't get two down every direction. Because um, I definitely need... Um, you know, I want at least three for some reflex. But let's just do the best we can gathering mana here with our, uh, our big old fat cube. Let's see how that works out. Now, I could throw down a bunch of spiders, too. Um, I feel like spiders would probably be a little helpful. Are we just not gathering any mana? Looks like we burned through everything, though. So that's a plus. All right, so we definitely got enough left to build our reflex. We got three 
Oh, we got a copter ogre and then a regular ogre here. There we go. We got uh, we got a little bit of juice flowing that time anyway. So yeah, anyway, the goal is going to be to try to tower boost this. I think with six... I'm not sure what I want to do here with the reflex with six DU left. Uh, if I would have built these things a little tighter together, I might have a little better time. But yeah, I don't think... I don't think I'm going to have enough to do what I want. No. How do we want to do this? I should have built these way tighter together. Let's go 2DU that way. Uh, we'll go 2DU this way. And then we'll try to go... What? 1DU. And 1DU. It leaves a little bit of gap there, but it's pretty decent coverage altogether. Um, let's get some upgrades in. In fact, do I want to put my booster down now? Uh, a little late. I'll just uh, wait for the next wave on the tower booster here. And uh, try to just spam massive upgrades into these DSTs. Not sure, like I said, not sure how uh, this is going to work out. But I'm going to give it a whirl anyway. Like I got a, got a little reflect beam upgrade in there too. Which uh, I guess will be just fine. And the lovely spiders. I think the waves will run a lot smoother if I get some tower boosters in here too. Let's see, we're going to have to handle this guy, aren't we? Got a copter as well. And, all right, well, we got done with the wave. Now, what do we want to do? Some spiders? Uh, let's do it. Let's try to get some spiders going here. I think these spiders will just end up getting wrecked, but we will find out uh, very, very shortly. Can't hurt, right? All right, we got spiders. Um, we also have what? We got one more wave. We can go ahead and get some uh, tower boosters in here, though. Let's grab uh, one with range and rate, and then we'll grab another, maybe. Where are you? There we go. We'll grab another with uh, rate and power. Oh, he didn't make it. He didn't make the cut. And then I'm going to want to swap over to my um, to my tower booster next wave. Shooting at my own spiders here. Ooh, the copters. The copters are getting uppity. And these copters are all up in here. And like I said, I think this will be a little bit of a different experience when I have my tower booster down. I think some of these will get burned out a little easier. Good lord, man. I am just getting overrun here now. Grab whatever we can in upgrades. All right, one baddie left. All right, let's see. What, uh...
All right, so there is my other booster. Let's get uh, get him right there. That one seems to be just fine. And I need to swap. Good lord, I almost forgot. That would have been tragic. All right, let's let it fly. Like I said, this should be a little different of an experience here. Just boosting it out. And I'm not sure how this boss fight is going to go. Obviously, ignoring the mechanics is um, always a little suspect. But my best attempt so far, um, I had him down to like, I don't know, less than 20% health or whatever, was using towers to kill him. So that is what I'm going to go for here. I mean, the waves burn in relatively easy. We got a big old build up of copters there, but... Getting, they're getting handled, just not very quickly. All right, let's kill our tower boost here. And uh, just prepare for the bossery to come. Let's see, can I get one more upgrade in? Go with that, and then uh, we'll yoink a little bit more mana to get started here on the wave. And yeah, like I said, uh, let's see how it goes. Could uh, could be quite sketch. Um, hopefully, I get a W here. We will find out. Here comes the ancient dragon and all of his furious glory. So ignoring the ballista mechanic here altogether, and I, if I had a little better DPS hero, I don't think I would do that. I think I would use the ballistas. But I'm going to try this, uh, try out this tower booster route again here. And see what we can do. Like I said, uh, this is and will be quite scuffed. Right, 1.18 billion health. He's not burning very quick. Spider's going down left and right. Now the problem is going to come if we get any frontal shots there where I don't have good reflect beams down. Um, that's going to be an issue, uh, as those meteors are going to, I'm assuming they're going to one-tap stuff. I don't like those spiders being down, but not a whole lot I can do about it right at the moment. All right, we got to pass half. It's actually going really, really well so far. Don't want to jinx it. And then he stopped. We get him down a little ways, and then the damage just stops. So he, he's not in a sweet spot, is the deal. If he could get back around to where those double DSTs are, it would be happy times here. Oh, come on, burn. Burn! Oh, yeah. oh my god, that was so close. But there we go, y'all. We got the win. So that is Ruthless Hardcore, uh, the summit in all of its scuffed glory. Um, certainly not the ideal build uh, for it, but I don't know what the ideal build for it is. So with that in mind, uh, I had to do a little trial and error and just see what was going to work.
But there we go, y'all. That is going to get it for this time around. So uh, thank you all so, so much for watching. Uh, hopefully everyone's having a wonderful week. And I will see you all next time. Take it easy, y'all.